Ông quay cho Ông chúng tôi nhận ra và cảm ơn to Cái chúng ta đã có thể xảy ra Nâng bắt đầu về cái chúng tôi Cảm ơn các bạn đã theo dõi và hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những video hấp dẫn Hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những video hấp dẫn Hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những video hấp dẫn Hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những video hấp dẫn Hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những video hấp dẫn sau thì nói chung là lục cho cầm khởi sáu hai tàu chụp bộ một hồi dưới này thì sẽ xây miền cà cà pìa và này miền bị thiên cà cà pìa xây còn tại bị bực mấy nít cái này mà này tìm muốn nít rồi mà mà tìm muốn nít dương khởi thà xã xây ban chơi chụp ba nơi chụp chụp lại từ nương chụp nuôi từ nương chụp nuôi rồi bỏ thà để nhà thà quạt mà chơi bên nít cứ quạt miền khai ở vậy đó quạt mình mình rui hay bị hướng sơn sọc vậy đó đối với chúng cho là thật tá hai đối với ban kia tất cả các chặt thuyền cá cá biển ở xã xây rụm ní rồi còn làm lồng lập vậy bạn mình đi rụm ní cùng lực đối chống người ta không biết biết miền này từ ngõ bờ sơn na xã xây mình khai rồi còn mình miền phải được rồi vay biển sơn sọc bọc luôn sau hai đối ban tất cả các chặt thuyền cá bạn mình đi chơi cùng lực đối chống người ta cua tai xua đối làm lồng lập bạn mình đi đối thoại nào lồng vinh đối với thuyền cá cá biển mình cua chặt người lớn làm lồng lập bạn mình đi rụm ní tê và số một còn ní chi cùng lập một con bọc nhưng mà chia cả cọt sầm quan rồi coi chia cả sơn nào sống hay bờ sơn nào sống trời miền phố thả sầm ăn hay trầm trời và khi cả sầm cọt sầm quan phía kia đầu tiên tiết mình chạm bách vừa cài chơi lòi tôm rồi cài cọt sầm quan là bây gì cài cọt sầm quan cứ cài cọt sầm quan chấm tiệt tôn nên cọt sầm quan phó hay nên sầm nào sống phò thả bờ sơn nào có cọt chơi lòi chụp ảnh nổi bùm một sao nào cả cọt mình miền phơi chơi ấy đấy đối với vị thiền ca ca cái ca phía mình cua miền tề nít chia sầm nào bọc nhom bà ông nhom đây bạn đã say tay mà đòn tới phù sầm nào rồi bọc lốp thì muối cứ ăn chụp ảnh lo tí chia ca cọt sầm cọt phong chia sầm nào phong thì bốn chia ca cọt sầm cọt khởi mớ chia sầm nào phong ca cọt sầm cọt phong thì biết không biết tập ăn hay đấy bây ấy thì ông nhom đây bạn ai lư mua lợt than này sầm nào xong chỉ lấy lại số rồi bỏ khi bỏ đời mà đang rập vào bên đi rụm này ta mà dễ mình từ vì nó mốc năm nàng đời mà đang rập vào này đời miền ca sắc xa trai chỉ riêng phí ta mà dễ và thiên ông gặp hiệp quang phía xa xây đường này chồng đi nhàng mặt chất và tôi mất ông nhầm rẹp ban thư ca trên đây dùm rạch môi chúc bạc lo rụi hơi và sân bà lô chẳng đố tới miền ca chúc bạc lo hay bằng hai hết đại ban chúc bạc lo hầm mềm dây trù trù hình chẳng bàn thì dương mình ăn ở nhà đây lộn dây bạp này tiết tỉ anh chơi Thank you, Mr. President. Some awkward look at him. We were uh, at the break. We were discussing. Uh, your father is in prison. My last question uh, on this subject. Um, did you ever learn uh, subsequent? Uh, after your father was released uh, at any time, uh, who the chief of Office 204 was? I'm going to uh, turn now to the period uh, where you were uh, sent uh, to Damriel uh, uh, Mountain and then to work at Frank to Chan. Uh, in interview E319.1.23 and answer 56, you stated that you were part of a six-man military unit that also included Sim, Son, and a person named Surat. 
to an answer 69 you then identified as um, small or little Deutsch. Two of these people, Son, Ben Son, and Little Deutsch, known as Sre Tan, have already testified in this trial, and they have both confirmed that they were part of that six-man unit with you. Van Son, uh, also on the 5th of March this year, E1 272.1 at 10.44.44 to 10.45.32 that testified that you and he were cousins. Can you confirm whether you and Van Son were cousins and also whether you were in the same military unit uh, as your cousin Son, Sim, and Little Deutsch, uh, both before you came to Krang Tachan and while you were working at prison. Let me follow up to clarify. Um, with regard to either uh, Van Son, Sim or uh, Little Deutsch, uh, were you in the same unit as any of those people before going to Krang Tachan? Let me follow up a little more. Uh, in your OCIJ statement E319.1.23, that answer number 19, you described how prior to being sent to Krang Tachan, quote, I was assigned to prepare the arrest of Prum Son, who had been accused of betraying the revolution on Phnom Damri Romeo Mountain, Samkok District, quote. And today, uh, you testify that your unit was stationed at Damri Romeo uh, with the assignment to arrest Prum Son in 1975. Um, in his trial testimony on the 3rd of March 2015, this is E1 slash 270.1. 14, 23, 27, 14, 27, uh, your cousin uh, Van Son also described how he was sent to Damri Romeo to arrest uh, before uh, his unit was assigned My question for you, uh, does this refresh your recollection uh, that you uh, and your cousin Van Son uh, were both sent to Damri Romeo to try to arrest Prum Son and after that were sent to Prum Son?
your cousin uh, also testified to this court on that same day, the 3rd of March, 2015. Uh, this reference is E1 slash 270.1 at 46 that the two of you, along with Sin and Little Deutsch, uh, all were sent to Trang Te Chan at the same time. Does that refresh your recollection uh, that you, Son, Sin and Little all started working at Trang Te Chan at the same time? Does that refresh your recollection that you, Son, Sin and Little Deutsch, all started working Van Son uh, also Van Son testified on that same day at 14, 10, 18, that uh, he began to work at Tank Chan in late 1975. The other members of the unit, uh, Sim, uh, testified uh, in his OCIJ interview, D40-20, in the very first question that he was sent to Krang Chan during the rice harvest in 1976. Uh, and in his testimony in this trial on the 19th of February of this year, E1 266.1 Little Dooch admitted that he was transferred to Krang Chan in late 1976. Does this refresh your recollection, uh, Mr. Civil Party, that you, Son, Sim, and Little Dooch all started working at Krang Chan in either late 19 1975 or 1976 and not in 1977 as you testified Thank you for clarifying that. I want to ask you about another um, statement you made in your interview, E319.1.23, and this is at question and answer numbers 48 to 49. Uh, you testified uh, that and you had a god-grandfather named Tachem, uh, who was long-time friends with Krang Tachan, prison chief on, and that you saw Tachem come to visit Ta'an at the prison. And in answer 51, you gave the following testimony. Question. Was it because of the good friendship between Ta'an and Ta'chen that you were appointed head of security guards at Krang Ta'chen? Answer, yes, that was the reason I was appointed head of the prison guards. First, I'd like you to tell me a little bit about your God grandfather Tachem. Uh, where was he from and what did he do? Uh, គាត់បានរស់នៅជាមួយស្គាល់គាត់តាំងពីនឹងមកលោកហូតមិនដែលបានស្គាល់សាច់ជាមីទេគឺសាច់ញាតដល់ទេទេតែកើចំណុនលុ
ดำใบคลายแต่เฮียนในนั่งตอบลำดอกประโยชน์เนี่ยเต้ามีนกาครูถนัดมาไอ้ก็สกอลกอดตามไปนั่งมองเราหดมองมาและเมื่อคนเหล่านั้นไปดูนักเรียนตัวนักเรียนวัยเด็กก็เชื่อไปเชื่อจนทอมนาปัญกาปีสมัยก็ทุกครูจำนวนล้นน้อยคือกระทาก็ปุ๊บมาอ่านได้ปนองมา You indicated that Lokman, um, uh, you and your family lived with Tachem after you were evacuated uh, from your village. But when was it that you were evacuated from your village and your family uh, lived with Tachem? No, pe na dai ke chum li lok chen pi phum sok ro ban lok hai lok to ro no chum mui ta che mi nong. ขนมชนะมกวนรมวนรอยจัดสับมวยหรือหนึ่งจันสับปีมาอาทักยูสมอกุลใน same interview นกนกกระชับเพียงดอกแดงนกรองจำลาย You gave the following testimony. This is E again. E three nineteen. Question: Did the guards carry guns? Answer: Yes, they did. And a quote: Can you tell us what type of gun did the guards carry? บาดอาวุธออกเข้มกันกับเพลิงโลกรามตะจันนั่นคือกับเพลิงกีฮาวท่าอมไซไอ้นังเซกาเซบาดนี่ผมอยากถามคุณคำถามหนึ่งคุณสมศรีคุณกล่าวถึงคำถามก่อนที่ A questions earlier identifying the leaders of Krang Tachan, including Tachan. In interview E three nineteen point one point two three, at answer fifty three, you testified in response to the question who supervised the guards. Your answer was Tachan himself. And in answers 104 to 106 of that same interview, you described self-criticism and life-view meetings that were led by Ta'an, at which he warned you about escaping and, quote, instructed us to be responsible for the prisoners and prevent their escape, end of quote. My first question is: Can you tell us where these self-criticism or life view meetings were held? And who all participated in those meetings? So these were meetings for the 
ហើយនេះគឺជាកិច្ចប្រជុំសម្រាប់ហើយយុទ្ធជននិងកម្មាភិបាលដែលធ្វើការនៅគុកក្រាំងតាច័ន្ទមែនឬអត់ទេ How often did uh, prison uh, chief on uh, conduct meetings like this? And you've talked about uh, the instructions you received at this meeting and the commitment you had to make regarding prisoners not escaping. Can you remember and tell us a little bit about other subjects that were discussed at these meetings led by Ta'an? បាទក្នុងនោះក្នុងរោងចំណុំនោះគឺគេនិយាយណែនាំយុទ្ធជនទាំងអស់តាមមុខសញ្ញារៀងរៀងខ្លួនតែបើសិនជាបងប្អូន
in October 2001, and he attributed the following statement to you and another guard. I quote, the former Padres Chanta and Sang reported that its prisoner escort rang a bell that hung from a mango tree just west of the center. Upon hearing the bell, the Padres came out to meet the prisoners and led them to cells inside. Uh, My first question for you, uh, was there a bell outside the Krang Tachan compound uh, that was rung when prisoners were brought to the entrance of the compound? Just to clarify, um, do you mean that the bell was outside the outer fence as opposed to the inner fence? The second excerpt I just read to you was a statement uh, uh, attributed to you uh, by a researcher named Meng Tri E who interviewed you in 2001. Do you remember being interviewed in 2001 uh, by a person who was uh, writing a book or doing research? Let me ask you now, uh, turn to the subject of the types um, of prisoners um, at Krang uh, Can you tell us uh, what types of prisoners uh, were sent uh, to the Krang Tachan security office? Let me refresh your recollection um, with two uh, statements that you provided to the investigating judges. Uh, first, in interview E319.1.23, at answer 91, you stated, quote, there was a mixture of prisoners. They were arrested on accusations they had been against the revolution, end of quote. And in your interview D40-21 at Khmer 00165342, English 00223551, and French 00524330, you testified as follows. Question. What offenses had the prisoners held there committed? 
Answer. Some had connections to officials of previous times. Some had deserted the ranks. Some had been sexually immoral. My first question, what did you mean by prisoners who had connections to officials of previous times? บ่ចឹងកាលពីមុននឹងគេគេអាចខាតមមណាស់បើអញ្ចឹងកាលពីមុននឹងគេខ្ញុំយល់ឃើញថាករណីនេះក៏តែ And when you talk about the previous regime, are you referring to the law no regime? Did the prisoners at Krang Tachan include uh, former Law Nol soldiers or officials uh, or people who were relatives or otherwise connected to former Law Nol people? Now, in the a book of Meng Tri E that I uh, read an excerpt to you earlier, uh, who interviewed you in October 2001, um, this is E3 2120 at English 00416383. Uh, and just to advise the court, we, we've requested a translation of. Um, uh, there is a chapter in this book that relates to district re-education offices and has substantial information regarding uh, Crank to Chan. So we made a request uh, that that entire chapter, which is about 30 pages, be translated. Um, uh, in any event, uh, the site, the uh, current site, English 416383. Um, the following statement is attributed to you. Uh, Mr. Civil Party, quote, Sot Sang took custody of former Law Nol soldiers and policemen arrested by the sub-district committee and sent to the Tramcock Re-Education Center. He explained that in mid-1975, a terrible number of prisoners were brought in day and night, night and day. There was no sleep and And Mr. Civil Party in this trial on the 4th of February, Sai Sen testified as follows. This is at E1 256.1 at 14, 30, the number of prisoners increased after the country was liberated, that is, after they liberated Phnom Penh. Those former Lanol soldiers were regarded as prison prisoners of war, and Phnom Penh people were considered 17 April people, and they were taken there. Um, my question to you, uh, what can you tell the court about the arrests of former Law Nol soldiers and policemen in Trampok District uh, in 1975? 
Did you subsequently become aware that large numbers of Law Nol soldiers had been arrested following liberation uh, following the 17th of April 1975? <laughs> What did you hear or observe uh, regarding the arrests of former Law Nol soldiers? I understand that, that you cannot read, so I will not, uh, I have a document that I want to ask you about. Um, instead, Mr. President, I will um, simply read the references uh, for the witness. Um, this is document uh, E3-4164. And it is a Krang Tachan prisoner list entitled Brief Biographies of Prisoners at Tramcock District Education Office. And um, my first question to you, um, Mr. Civil Party, um, the, the second and third prisoners on this list are, were two uh, female medics. Uh, that had been sent to Krang uh, a woman named Han, the full name was Uch Han, uh, and a woman named Vorn Sarun. Do you remember two female medic prisoners at Krang Tachan named Han? and Sarun, uh, who may have also been referred to as Rune. And do you remember how long uh, Han and Rune uh, were detained at Krang Tachan? This uh, prisoner list uh, includes uh, the prisoner's former position or occupation uh, and whether they were uh, 17 April people or base people. Of the 29 prisoners on this list, 
uh, 21 are identified as 17 April people and 6 as base people. In addition, 11 of the prisoners are identified as former Lonmol military and another as the son of a smashed Lonmol captain. My question for you, uh, Mr. Civil Party, uh, based on your observations as a guard at Krang Tachan, were there more prisoners who were 17 April people or more who were base people? Um, thank you, Mr. President. Um, two objections uh, is a leading question, uh, but most questions are leading questions. Uh, but more importantly, uh, this witness couldn't possibly say if somebody is a 17 April person or not. It means not uh, tattooed on their forehead. Um, so he cannot read. Uh, the only way he can determine if somebody is a 17 April person is uh, probably by But certainly uh, this uh, witness is not able to determine uh, whether somebody is a 17 April person, yes or not. And Mr. President, if I may respond, uh, the question wasn't leading. It asked him for his observation. Um, second, there are uh, other ways, of course, that a guard who worked at Krang Tachan uh, could have information on this uh, observations, having learned where people were, were from, where they came from. Uh, or such matters. Um, so I think as a person who worked at Krang Tachan, uh, this is a uh, perfectly proper question for him to answer. បាទអង្គម្រះសម្រាប់បរិសេទចោលនៅត្រីចំទោះ <coughs> ដើមរងរបនេះឆ្លោយតបតែនឹងសំណួរចុងក្រោយដែលសួរឡើងដោយ <coughs> Thank you, Mr. Civil Party. Let me turn now um, to the question of the number of prisoners who were at Prang to Chan. Um, you provided some testimony uh, this morning about uh, arrival of prisoners and how many prisoners would arrive on given days. Um, also, in interview, your interview D40-21 at Khmer 00165-340, English 00223-550, French 00524-328. You were asked how many prisoners were usually at Krang Tachan. 
and your response was, quote, sometimes 20, sometimes 30, uh, end of quote. Now, I want to uh, read to you uh, some of the statements of your fellow uh, unit members who have uh, given evidence. Uh, your fellow guard, Sim, uh, testified as follows in D40-20, ERN reference to Mayor 00. 165333, English 00433572, French 00524321. Question. In general, how many prisoners were sent in at a time and how often? Answer. Sometimes 10, sometimes 5, sometimes 1, almost every single day. End of quote. Sim also testified at the same year end that there were three buildings for detention and that each building had two rows with 20 people in each row. Uh, Little Dooch, Sray Tan, uh, has testified in this court on the 19th of February 2015, reference E1-266.1 at 11-12-48-11-16-49. He testified that the number of prisoners brought in to Krangtachan varied from three or four up to 20 prisoners per day, that there were two detention buildings and that each building could hold about 50 to 60 prisoners. And your cousin, uh, Van Son, uh, acknowledged in his testimony to this court on the 4th of March, 2015, reference E1-271.1 to 9, stated that, quote, prisoners were sent in almost on a daily basis, end of quote, uh, and that each building could accommodate at least 50 prisoners. Now, um, Mr. Civil Party, um, you also acknowledged in your OCIJ interview that it was hard for you to estimate the number of prisoners because, and I quote, you never counted them. Is it possible that your estimate of the number of prisoners at Krang Tachan is low and that the number of prisoners there was higher and more consistent with the evidence we heard from the other three guards? ហើយអ្នកផ្សេងទៀតនោះគាត់ឆ្លើយថានៅទោសនោះគឺមានចំនួនច្រើនអញ្ចឹងតើលោកឆ្លើយតបយ៉ាងម៉េចដែរលោក
when the buildings were fully occupied, how many people uh, could they hold? I'm going to read to you uh, from another document uh, that's been admitted in this trial. Uh, it is document E3 slash 2109. E3 slash 2109. The ERN are Khmer 00068014. English 00276555 and French 00290272. Uh, Mr. Witt, Mr. Civil Party, this document is a, a report um, from Crank to Chan for the month of November 1977. Um, Mr. President, with your leave, um, may I display this on the screen? For what reason, Mr. President? He can't, he can't read. This is a public proceeding. It's, it's for the benefit of uh, the bench and for the members of the public. មានកាបអបប្រែទេ <coughs> It, it, was there a translation of the ERN, or do I need to repeat? Repeat the whole question. I understand from my colleague, but what, what wasn't translated was my response to um, counsel, uh, Mr. Kope. My response to him was that um, the uh, displaying on the screen is not just for the benefit of the civil party uh, or witness, it's for the benefit of the court and the public. Uh, so that's the reason for the request to display the document on the screen. Uh, Mr. Civil Party, um, this document um, reported that uh, during the month of November 1977, uh, 75 new prisoners had entered, 92 prisoners were purged, Six died of illness, and one, a lieutenant colonel, had been removed to sector by Ankar, leaving a total of 85 prisoners as of the end of that month. Uh, this report uh, tells us then that there were 109 prisoners at Krang Tachan at the start of November 1977. Uh, over the course of that month, 75 new prisoners arrived, 
99 were purged, died, or transferred, leaving a total of 85 at the end of the month. Uh, does that refresh your recollection that as of late 1977, there were typically around 100 prisoners at Kang Tachan at any given time? មានចឹងទេបាទខ្ញុំសូមជម្រាបដល់ក្នុងនោះគឺខ្ញុំមិនបានចាំទេពីព្រោះបាទថាមិនបានចាំឆ្នាំខែយូកាលពេលវេលា
Uh, Mr. President, I'm about to change to a different uh, subject if this is a convenient time. ບາດອົງກຸນເປັນຍາລົງລະລິລະລິດໍປີລະສໍາລະໃຫ້ຕ້ອງໃຫ້ອົງ <coughs> ແລະລູກຍາຍມສໍານັງ <coughs> ประกอบឲ្យอันตรยะมติคมแข้งนวมคลวนโลกเคือสมพรตลอดประกันประตุบโรงจำข้างกรองสาธารณการนี้ในประกอบឲ្យนวมคลวนก็ตลอดมาโ